what's going on guys welcome back to vv vision uh it's just me for this video but uh yeah i just want to make a little reddit video and uh i was also going to go through some different namco games and just kind of look at those because i was having a lot of fun looking at those uh and i think if namco comes which you know it's really debatable um i think there's a lot of interesting content that we could see from that so yeah i just wanted to kind of look through and see what possibilities could lie within the realm of namco um just to get started though on reddit we're gonna start like a little less than two days ago and uh here we got the cheapest single set it was a bunch of captain carters um yeah i definitely agree with that and if you guys haven't picked up a captain carter i would consider it even though i want to clarify this is not financial advice i'm not a financial advisor do your own due diligence um yeah don't listen to what I say and go like buy something. I'm just sharing my opinion. But yeah, my opinion, Captain Carter is a move right now because I mean, single or full set, like what, 300 roughly, something like that. I, in the future, once a uh, collector's program comes out and everything, I see it booming. So I picked one up just to hold anyways, but I do think it'll boom auctions if you don't pay for item how long are you banned i've honestly never i don't even uh, i have no idea let me know in the comments if you guys know i don't really participate in auctions let me know if you've had any good experiences with auctions though because i've really i've just struggled a lot of the time and not really made much profit so it wasn't really worth like all the effort but yeah um Got the watcher Miles Morales. Wish I would have got that. Didn't. Um, it's no big deal. We'll get him in the next one. Uh, <laughs> the uh, hope you're reading your comics. Comic Ghost Rider is pretty funny character. Great artwork. I don't. I mean, I haven't read them, but it is something I will do in the future when I have a better format to read them on. But there's definitely a couple that I am saving. I saved New Mutants just because the artwork in the entire book is like. I love that. So, um, yeah, I'll read them at some point, but I do really, I, especially the older ones. I just love the artwork style. So I'm definitely, I'll, I'll get to it, you know, um, who plans to hodl bottom left? What? Oh yeah. I mean, ah, they, they're they pretty cheap right now too. I, I've thought about picking up one of those uncommons for like less than a hundred bucks or whatever it's sitting at. So why are comic prices dropping so hard literally 1k so many drops not enough users <sighs> yeah i think that's exactly it too many drops not enough users not enough money to buy stuff i've talked about this before um but yeah if you guys disagree with me let me know what you think in the comics or <sighs> comments Woo! too much comic talk here sorry guys um minimum specs needed to succeed i don't think it's that important i have like a 5s I feel like an older iPhone compared to what the majority of people have nowadays and uh, not great Wi-Fi connection on most of the drops I go for. And I've been able to snag a decent number of drops, um, but it's also just like luck timing. I don't know, but I, I did see stuff about like ethernet cables. I was thinking about giving that a try. If you guys have had experiences with ethernet cables that work, go ahead and let me know because I've considered it, but I just don't know if I want to invest in that as much just because I don't know how much of a difference it'll make. Um, but I've thought about stuff like that. Also, like taking the the case of your phone off, I think helps in some cases, like if you have a really thick like Mophie type case or something like that. Um, I have noticed, though, uh, I don't I just in comparison to like Carter's phone in terms of just running things, he has a, a older or a, a, a newer iPhone. Um, I think his just runs naturally faster and mine's just kind of worn out because it's so old. So I do think there is an advantage to the type of phone you have, like the more recent it is, the better. Ah, my ping is usually under like my holy crap ping is 22 seconds mine is like four usually and i still get drops so if you have that and you're not getting drops i don't think it's the connection but yeah that's kind of my experience we might make a video like that in the future um 
but I feel like things have really been covered. And there's some people who have given really good tips. Uh, I, I checked out Chevelle Anderson's video and I think he gave some good little pointers in there, especially thought if you guys haven't seen the little, uh, it's like you put your, your, your finger, I don't know, you hold the phone sideways and then you like use your other hand to like help leverage it and click faster. And I thought that was an interesting little gem from Cavell and then like checking your speed and everything. But I thought that was one of the most interesting things. I'll probably try that out on at least one drop, uh, blind box or whatever, or anything. I mean, just collectible because for some reason, a line gate has not been working for me. Um, half of VV when new capture system is in place. What? Oh, <laughs> Yeah, I definitely feel that because imagine like, what do you let me know if you guys have any like ideas as to like solutions to the botting and stuff, because I know they could probably try to like ban the emulators or whatever. I don't know how they do it because I'm not techie or anything like that. But um, I do think that like there's some people who just including myself, some of these I think I could end up fumbling and then like missing like a golden dragon girl uh to something like that would hurt would hurt real bad but if it does minimize the bots i think it would be really nice to see something but yeah that <laughs> that's rough uh let's see 44 bro there's no <laughs> if you guys have a 44 ping or a 53 ping and like these high of download numbers oh well, i guess that's not crazy but still I don't, I think you're chilling. I don't like my stats are way worse than this and I still get drops. So I don't think you guys have to like worry as much. Uh, but yeah, I think either of those are good. Let me know what you guys think. Also, let me know, like, if I'm just not accurate about anything I'm saying, uh, let me know because I don't really know much about like internet connection, but I know that my numbers are worse than both of these, uh, in both pictures. So yeah um why does everyone think of an oh what does everyone think i love that addition number let me know what you guys think but this is definitely something i would get i love repeats i love the palindromes where it's like uh you say it the uh, you know i don't know it'd be like oh one O oh, or like one yeah it, this i'm pretty sure is a palindrome technically but yeah it's I, I'm a big repeat man. Uh, and I don't know, you guys saw my mints. So you kind of have an idea of what kind of mints I like to go for, but I, that's a sweet little, uh, mint number lumpy space princess. One of my faves. How about yours? I do like it. I think I'd go for a fin before lumpy probably. Uh, but I'm still, I'm considering I'd need some extra gems just chilling in the background though, uh, in order to like, kind of pull the trigger on that purchase just because I don't know there's other things I kind of want to prioritize at the moment uh serial killers being one of them I'm getting that last fat breakfast baby let's go let's go um missed two drops due to something don't really know didn't get one switch to yeah I really have no suggestions for that because I don't get kicked I just like fumble the bag basically like I don't even, I just do, I just mess up all the time. I feel like a lot of them are my fault. That dragon girl is debatable, but a lot of them are my fault. Uh, I believe VV should collab with VR headset. I agree. I think, I don't know, they should collab, but I want to see them innovate when it comes to the VR headset. Like, I don't just make it more comfortable. Cause if you guys like VR is cool and all, okay. I get a little bit motion sick and stuff. Um, which I think is one thing that needs to be worked on in terms of VR is kind of like uh, accommodating to the community that gets like really motion sick because I know people who like can't play a game of like Apex because they'll puke. Um, and yeah, I think they should just try to make it a little lighter, maybe a little more like, I don't know, just ergonomic and comfortable and stuff. And I think making it maybe smaller, maybe wireless. I think there's a lot of things they could do. And I have, you know, have no idea the like possibilities there are, but 
I think they should try to like innovate the VR headset. And then I think they'd really be like top, top in terms of like overall everything, because right now that's like the only, it's the only area where I'm kind of waiting to see what VV does because I love everything about it. And the only issue I have is like, say you have a, a 5S iPhone like me, um, my showroom doesn't really look that great. And like things don't load super well in terms of like loading the AR and stuff. And even though some of them look really sweet, it still just doesn't, I think it can be so much better. And so that I'm just waiting to see what they do with the gamification and like just AR or VR in the VV verse, because uh, I just, things are going to be crazy. And I definitely see them innovating the VR headset and not just combining with someone, because I think they really have their like mindset on like long-term, like past what other people have been thinking. I don't know. That's just my take um tips and tricks for drop days we got granola warfare here let's go uh preparing for drops is this a video i think it might be a video uh is this like locked or something interesting bro why who locked that the moderators seem like they're trying to hide the secrets or something there i don't that's a little weird can't wait to get a statue or comic drop of spider-man me either this is so sweet let's go um i just like like carter and i were talking about in a recent video like i love everything they put out at this point they managed to make everything look great and especially like 3d collectibles are just getting better and better like i we're going up that's all i see all i see is up you know, down could be around, but <laughs> that, oh my God, <laughs> I can't edit these either. So you guys just get the complete raw video, but uh, if you're chilling with me, hope you're having a good day. Um, can't wait for Rockstar collectibles. That would be clean. Jimi Hendrix would be dope. Also, bro, imagine a Butt Thompson 3D collectible. That would be so clean. Like, <laughs> I would love to see that. I would definitely buy a Butt Thompson 3D VV collectible. Why won't the VV app work in Greece? I no idea. I have absolutely no idea. Breeding Lavitz lol. Yo. Yo. This guy's on to something. TSF Reddit, you are on to something. This is crazy. I, how did I not think of that? That like, I'm just like mind blown right now because now I want to try this out with all the ones I have. Yo, that's so clean. I wonder if this was edited or just like he made one slight, like just a little bit smaller than the other. And I wonder if it can only be done with the camo one. That's really interesting. I want to try that now. Um, let's see. Comic drop day, finally no longer restricted. Let's go. Shout out to Mauricio2075. Glad you're no longer restricted. How many complete sets do you own? I now have four, I think. Let's go. Uh, honestly, never. Oh, that's crazy. I thought more people would have had four. Well, I guess. I don't. That's wild. Um. I'm interested to see like where I'll fall in the like, I don't know, the rankings of collectors like in the master collector program, because I don't know, I feel like I'm not going to come up on any leaderboard like ever because there I feel like there are some whales out here. So this surprises me a little bit, but I guess there must be some new users, you know? Yes, finally got one. Am I in the club? Ah, I like the mint number on that, too uh is there <laughs> yo is that the actual discord finally cool edition number gem stack looking peak you're in the club nice yes sir bro that's cool i need to join that club because i have a superman and that's <laughs> carter and i made sure to hold ours for that especially once we uh like heard about it and everything so Market restriction removed. Let's go, me homies. Let's go. 
good luck uh, on drop day. Yeah, thank you. Uh, I was trying to manifest the drop. I'm not going to lie. I had a friend talking to me about it, and I was like, let's try it. Let's go for it, please. Let me, let me, like, let me give it a chance. So, you know, I was trying to manifest a hundred secret rares because I had my 15 emulators up uh, when I was multi-botting the drop. And uh, yeah, I didn't get anything. So no big deal. Also, I hope nobody takes that literally. I was not multi-botting, <laughs> but I really hope nobody actually believes that. But yeah, uh, wow, that was hardest yet. I didn't think it was the hardest yet. My phone just glitched out, sold out inst instantly. They always do. <laughs> Does BB need some sort of verification like CAPTCHA? Yeah, I mean, I I got one CAPTCHA ever, I think. Like, I don't even think I ever got two CAPTCHAs. And so, I don't know. Maybe they've just verified that I'm a human or something. But yeah, I like never get CAPTCHAs. Uh, first day back with full access to VV Market app, snatch a comic. Let's go. Also, let's go. Let's go. What is it? Uncommon? Ultra rare. Let's go. Okay, to mash or to time. What? I don't know what that means. Oh, I love the freaking SR, man. I can't believe I missed this job. Self-entitled, most definitely. 30,000 copies. Can't wait to do the symbol. <laughs> I mean, yeah, Every, people are just going to, I mean, I'm salty when I miss a drop. Everybody's sad when they miss a drop. It's a big rush. You want to get the drop, but I mean, I think that's just how it is. There's always going to be people who are kind of new to the experience of getting let down on a lot of drops. And I've definitely been lucky recently. So knock on wood, cause I'm not trying to go on a dry uh, streak here. UFO four undervalued common. I can't think that right now. If you know, you know. I don't know what that is, but I do know it's the secret rare variant, and I'm guessing it's worth a lot of money. Um, are you going for the poster drop tomorrow? Yes, I am. VV immutable price predictions. This is a good question. Let me know what you guys think prices will do when they hit Immutable X. I think they will start off like the same. Maybe a little bit more if there's any kind of gas fees, but I don't think there will be. Um, but long term, going up. I think there's just more people there, more money. And even though they are like, you know, there might be 8,000 of the Superman or whatever, uh, or like, even if there's like 2000 or something, even though there are repeats, I still think people will like the fact that they're AR because you can't do that with any other NFTs that I've seen on OpenSea. And so Vivi's just bringing something new with that one. Two, Vivi's bringing exposure to Vivi, which is, I think, it's a real good contender for OpenSea in my opinion. And it's just them dropping the NFTs. So I think it's going to go crazy. And I do see prices going up. Um, I don't know though. I really can't predict just because I don't, I'm amazed. Like open CLC, a JPEG of like a lion or a, I don't know, like things. I don't even really think the art is that cool for going for like five ETH or something like that. And I'm like, holy crap. Like who spent like what? 20 grand on this? Like it's crazy. So let me know what you guys think. If you know a little more about that. Cause I really, I don't know much. Um, but I see things going up in very short. I see things going up, maybe doubling a little sooner due to open C um, just because I think there's a lot more people there with a lot more money looking to flip for big money and stuff like that. So I, yeah, I think it'll be some beneficial exposure to the marketplace or the, like, uh, I don't even know the ecosystem. I don't know. Anyone have an idea what this could mean? I'm now that I'm seeing the themes, I'm thinking Fortnite for some reason. I don't think that's the end from Fortnite, but the colors for some reason remind me of Fortnite. And so I'm tempted. I'm trying to think if there's a toy shop or anything like that. Kid Robot, no. Hmm. 
I think I wonder if they're going to do another one of those things like they did for the first Spider-Man release or whatever, um, where they like posted like multiple Instagram pictures that were just like puzzle pieces to the big picture. I feel like they're going to do that. So we'll probably get some more hints soon. Um, I feel like this might be like the last letter in it or something. <sighs> I really have no idea. That's such a hard one, but yeah, that's kind of my guess is we talk about it in the other video. If you guys want to check that out, anyone having issues with logging in, I did before, but yo, someone else saw it. That's funny. That's crazy. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, seeing the comparison, I don't think they're similar at all, but the colors just really reminded me of Fortnite. Mystery tease continues. This was 44 minutes ago. And hmm, I might do a little bit of research to try to figure out what this is, like brands that end in EN or something. I don't want to do it on the Reddit just because it'll take a little bit, but I think Nintendo is coming. Oh, oh, let's go. Okay, we've got the EN in Nintendo, but I feel like the N is the last letter. So I don't know. I'm going to I'm going to get into some of that stuff uh probably in another video. I might do another solo video. We'll see. But first, I did want to go back and view these uh these old Namco games in case it is, even though I don't think it even is anymore, but I, you know, Vivi, if you're watching this, please bring some of these things to Vivi because I think they would be pretty sweet to have an NFT of, but yeah, let me know what you guys think. Um, I I'm tempted on Nintendo. I don't think it's Fortnite. It's hard to tell, but tell me something like this, like even a poster of it wouldn't look sweet in VV format. Like, especially if there's a 3D collectible of this, it'd go crazy. Um, yeah, I mean, that's, that's all I really got. I mean, let me know what you guys think about all that's going on, this secret drop. If you have any idea what the E and the N means, um, but yeah, I hope you guys had a good day. Thank you so much for the support. Uh, I can't thank you guys enough. It's crazy. We got like 550 subs. It's wild. So yeah, I hope you guys have a good rest of your day. And I will see you in the next video. Let's go. Let's go, me homies. Let's go.